Hello. In this video, I would like to show you how you can use the ADI Connect app to display in-flight weather on third-party applications. In this example, I am going to use SkyDemon. This video um, applies to the ADI 110, 120 and 130 devices and the ADI Connect for Iridium Go solution. On the other ADL devices, ADL 140 to ADL 200, there is a direct weather data broadcast from the device, which is different from the procedure shown in this video. So this video is really about how the ADL Connect app can bring third-party application weather features to legacy devices and the Iridium Go solution. So the very first step is to make sure the ADI Connect app has got the proper authorization. So we go to the general settings of the iPad and then we scroll down to the privacy section and then we make sure that the location services are on and further when we select the ADI Connect app that it's configured on the always setting. That's very important because uh, might not be obvious, but this uh, always location authorization also implies that the ADI Connect app is able to run in the background and broadcast the weather data to other applications. Now that we are sure that the configuration is right, I can switch over to the ADI Connect app. For this example, I'm connected to an Iridium Go device, but it would be exactly the same for an ADI 110, 120 or 130. So I did already download some weather from a route to Norway and as you can see there's quite some weather activity on the Norwegian coast. So now I can switch over to the SkyDemon app. There the first step is to make sure the configuration is alright. So I go to the general settings to the third party devices and make sure the GDI90 compatible device is enabled. Then I can select the Go Flying tab and it will let me choose the GDI90 compatible device as the position and also the weather data source. And now I start the navigation and as you can see the weather data is already flowing in. It takes a few moments and then the weather data for a whole route to Norway will be visible. The ADA Connect app will continue sending the weather data as a broadcast to SkyDemon or another GDL90 compatible app. And uh, whatever changes to the weather data occur in the ADA Connect app will also be transmitted. So, for example, if you put the ADA system on automatic downloads every 15 minutes, the new weather data will flow in automatically into the third party app without any further interaction. Finally, to avoid a well-known issue on the SkyDemon app, just make sure that you have the rainfall layer activated because uh, this is required for SkyDemon to show also the ADI Connect weather. So I hope this video gave you a short introduction on how you can display the weather and third-party apps, in this case SkyDemon, using the ADL system with this latest improvement of the ADL Connect app. This is now possible from the very first ADL 110 device to the latest ADL 200 and Iridium Go solution. Thanks a lot for watching and fly safe.